Toga Zayani and welcome to Intimate Sessions with Gogo Mathevizulu. I would like to take you on a journey of getting your life back on track. Um, I would like to take you on a journey of self-discovery and I would like to take you on a journey of owning your life and controlling your life as best as you can. Have you ever found yourself in situations where you feel you may be off balance, where you finding yourself blaming people, where you finding yourself not in the best moods, where you finding yourself constantly fighting with people? I would like to say to you, go. We are going to get it together. Now it is established you have found someone whom you're working with on your, on your journey of getting it together. Your name in this exercise is called Maria. Maria, I would like to say to you, go. What is your goal? I know you want to get better, but what is your goal? In the comfort of your own home, Maria, can you write a list on all the things you want to achieve? We are speaking of something viable, something that you know you can put your efforts into, something we know go, it won't make you lazy. I know you will find days where you're a bit slow towards, you know, reaching your, your G, your goal, Maria. But I'm saying to you, go, you need to invest your time into your goal. You need to apply your mind. What is it that you want to achieve, Maria? What is your goal? Write, write 10 things that you would like to achieve. Not necessarily 10. It may be that one thing that you've always wanted to, to achieve. But, Maria, what is your goal? Your reality. How does it look for you? Are you dreaming of you working towards that goal? Do you have that power to go towards that goal? Are you just sitting there waiting for something to happen? What is your contribution to the reality of your goal? I know you want to get better, but what are the realistic obstacles or things that are holding you back? Write them down. And on that note, also add on the things that are not holding you back in achieving your goal of getting better. Remember, getting it together is a process where it needs you to be patient with yourself. You need to be liberated with who you are. You need to be kind to yourself. You need to understand the contributions to where you are today. You having this opportunity of owning up and say, listen, I'm getting my life back. There's nothing wrong. It's part of reality. What is your reality to your goal? Hmm? What is your reality? Write it down on a piece of paper. What's stopping this reality of you getting your life back? And what's not stopping this reality of getting your life back? Write it down. Many of us are stuck. We don't have options. But some of us have an opportunity of options. What are your options towards your goal? What are your options in your reality? What are your options? What are your options? What can you do? Can you go into A? Can you go into B? Do you have C? Those are the kind of options it is that you have. Your healer or somebody who's, who's, who's with you on this journey. How are they encouraging you? Are they adding on more to where you are or are they leaving you to slack behind? What are your options? Is it only Ngangayashint? That is your option. Can you go to church? Do you pray more? What are your options towards tackling this problem that you're in, Maria? What is it? Speak. You know, what if I say to you, go, I feel generous. I would like to take five people on a free session for six weeks and let you guys be the test of it. You know, throw in testimonials about the coaching sessions that I have. Is that an option for you? What are your options? You found your goal. You found your reality. What are your options to bring these two together? What are your options, Maria? Your options. So, Maria. Now that you've written your goals, you know what your goals are. Now that you've checked your reality, can they come to life? Now that you've seen the options that you can take or, or, or use towards you know, attaining your goal and making it a reality, I have one question for you or ask. <laughs> what will you do? What is it that you will do? What is it that you will do? You're going to write on a piece of paper your will do's. If you want to go study for a new course, um, you will write that I will do, you know, register. Um, if you want to open up a business, I will, you know, register. If you want to see changes in your life, those are your will do's. What is it that you will do? 
when I started intimate sessions with Gogo Matlevizulu in 2015, it started so in individual sessions and it further went on into couple sessions. It further went on into family sessions and group sessions. I have helped people liberate themselves with who they are. I've helped people find peace and restoration in their relationships and in their lives. I would like to say to you, don't miss out the opportunity on the videos that I'll be sharing with you. Like I mentioned, this is a highlight of how I, as Gogo Matlebe Zulu work. And I would like to say, go intimate session does not end here. I'll be sharing with you topics on how you can get your life together, how you can move from point A to point B. Um, a highlight of how I work essentially, this is work that I have collected since 2015 and I keep adding notes, I keep adding, you know, stuff in my workbook actually to not only better sessions that I have with, with my clients privately but to also give a highlight to those who need, you know, help. And if you want to book in for a, a individual session, a group session, a couple session, a family session, my information is below and have a wonderful day.